the FNAF lore thing is so funny. Like Matt, do you see how much how many videos Matt Pat squeezes out of FNAF? Like it's it's, it's honestly impressive. inspiring. Yeah, that I feel like he has a stake in the company and he just doesn't say it. There's no way that man has like all. <laughs> come on now. <laughs> There, there's inside. I feel like there's a lot of insider trading going on in the world of inside FNAF YouTube trading. content. There well, is. If, if it was insider trading, then they wouldn't have caught him like ripping off like Reddit posts and stuff. Oh, of course he's gonna rip <laughs> on. You think Matt Pat's gonna come back and no, like he, actually he like research for this stuff? Yeah, exactly. The writers are on Reddit. He just says mm-hmm. like, come there. Like, I, All right, here's a Google. So I know one of the writers that uh, he had for, like, a Sword Art Online video, an anime video. And, like, you know how he adds jokes? One of the jokes yeah. he added in his video is, like, and not even that lolly over there is sexier than math. And it's like, whoa. What? Whoa. <laughs> whoa. Oh. He didn't know what lollies are. I've seen that clip. That's he, was, he just straight up read, like, he got someone to write him a script for that video, like an anime YouTuber, and he just read that joke. Oh, my like, God. If nothing was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> not even that lolly on the other page and i was like oh god the lo- that's amazing <laughs> he probably i wonder if he knew what it meant or if he just read it and just kind of there's no <laughs> there's way no he way. knew what it meant how the hell would mad pat not know a lolly is right. lolly whatever the hell like come on now <laughs> Come on, Matt's not like that innocent. He's not like that. He's not. Old. I don't know about that dude. It. He's never He's watched. Never watched porn, so like, I refuse to believe that. I'm gonna one hundred percent. Like, I don't believe a man when he says I've never seen one porn. Dude, you look at it out of pure curiosity. Okay, come on now. Never seen it. Never seen nothing nope. like that. <laughs> Three holes, two holes, <laughs> no holes for me. Wait, wait. So he's what's his like? Come on now, like he. What is he? Is he trying to appeal to the kid audience like that? I, no, no. I think oh yeah, he's, he's appealing to the kids' parents and to brands. Wait, does Dude, he even say that? Or he's trying to appear brand. No, safe? there's. This is he my favorite that? clip on the internet. He really said that. Yeah. Matt Pat saying there. Well, I've never watched. <laughs> uh, but and you see his wife like. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like okay. <laughs> It's a weird thing clip. to put it's out like, there. It's like, it's my favorite clip. Poor guy. It's my favorite yeah. clip ever. He's like, I've never seen adult content. That's a no-no. <laughs> like, what the <laughs> fuck? <Yeah. laughs> trying to be a good role model. Yeah. That's icky. I, I feel, no, I, bullshit. That's I want to see the car facts on that dude's, like, internet search history. <laughs> it's like, that's, I, don't, I don't count it. I bet you, because here's the thing. I know that when you get to a certain age and you watch that kind of shit, you don't even use incognito mode. Like, I don't, I don't bother with incognito. I don't yeah. care. Like, who's checking my search history? God already checked before I Googled, okay? So it's like, <laughs> I'm already screwed in that department. My mom's not going to come up. It's like, all right, son, give me your phone. Let me check your search history. Oh, wow, you're doing this totally normal thing that most people your age do. Okay, fuck it. You're gone. Mm-hmm. But, like, that's... I don't I don't believe... I don't believe that he doesn't... Do, I don't know. It, I haven't seen a Minecraft YouTuber come out and say that, dude. I haven't seen mm-hmm. fucking Dream come out and say... All right, he hasn't tweeted out. It's like, hey, guys... Just let you know, I've never Googled the P O R N in my life. Like, that's a no no. Like, well, I mean, this dude definitely did because his thumbnail to like his biggest boobs in gaming video is. Okay? So <laughs> either, either he paid people to look up the porn on his behalf. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> or he took the bullet himself. Took the bullet. <laughs> so like well like if you paid somebody money no dude he has a lot of points. how does luigi measure up you can't make dude, a video talking video about so much <laughs> you can't make a video talking about a fucking character's size and not google ones in your life come on now like what is this are smite goddesses too sexy yo matt was running the game he knew when youtube's <laughs> demonetization yo, was gonna dude, come I, in matt is by the way up, never like, watched porn. he is the ultimate youtuber businessman okay like he starts new channels based on like you know whatever could get, be trendy or whatever he wanted to make music theory but he didn't because he didn't want to deal with like the dmca system like, mm-hmm. he's been skirting the lines. Dude, I just looked at his one age-restricted video. He has one age-restricted. Biggest, best boobs in gaming. So and I I'm think, at, like, three minutes, and he shows he, Lara Croft from the PS1. Dude, uh, you can't jack off to that. It's on the track. <laughs> it's a fucking... It's <laughs> hey, hey. Them hey, 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 Okay, he could do it. He could do it. <laughs> Matt Pat's the guy that would like he would like complain about Tifa in the new Final Fantasy. <laughs> they made her less sexier. Yo, when wait, that when was it, when is our collab with Matt Pat and the quartering? 
I think that would be the oh crossover we all I, <laughs> I love the fact that when I saw the quartering, like, it was all those channels, was like, a quartering it when Resident Evil 3 was coming out, it's like, they put a goddamn hijab on Jill Valentine, how fucking dare they? I'm like, damn, dude. I mean, like, I've never, I, like, when I was playing PS1, like, even as, like, well, I guess I wasn't a horny kid back then. That came like during the PS2, PS3 era. You know, that's when the hormones kicked in. There's like, <laughs> pre-horny. There's, like three horn levels, you know? So it's like, I wasn't like playing FF7. Dude, I still to this day, and I feel like this has got to be a video I make, like the scientific breakdown of why you can't jack off to Tifa from Final Fantasy VII on the PS1. PS4, PS5, total total babe. You know, they, they have... The graphic artists can do a whole lot with shit nowadays. Okay, they can ray trace some titties, but back in the PS one days, you can't do it, dude. She looks like she looks like a Habbo Hotel character. Last I checked, you can't jack off to a Habbo Hotel character. It's not possible. And I, I've tried. Like I've put the actual concerted effort, not happened. Dude, you can sit there for thirty that? minutes mm-hmm. and not do it. <laughs> That's, thirty. This is fine. For science, I've made that it can't for be science. Done. Yeah. It was yeah, science. like I can definitively can expel any white pee for science, dude. I can write a peer-reviewed essay of Just not white. succeeding on that one. Okay, like if I, I can write a university-grade essay of why it's not possible. So when I see all these channels talk about like FF Seven, like ah, oh, they're they're making the characters less sexy. I'm like. I don't know what your definition of less sexy is. Like, is the fact that you're not seeing enough PS1 skin yeah, they don't, enough? They don't like tits when they're round, okay? They like triangular ones. <laughs> mm. <laughs> they like deformed action. Yeah, like, we don't like them bouncing around dead or alive style. No, we no, need no, them, no. like, static. <laughs> <laughs> we want to so be able to poke my that. eye out on a titty. Dead or alive. <laughs> you know, surprisingly, out of the one thing Rockstar Games has never done, despite making their game worlds look realistic, are boop physics. I've never actually seen a character with boop physics in their games recently. I would not Red boop Dead Two are not as realistic as some games out there. Unfortunately, well, I mean, like they gotta have <laughs> something, you know, like they gotta have like some action. You tell me for a company that's designed realistic horse testicles, they weren't gonna make like basic <laughs> boop physics. Like what? You know what? I'll give it to you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, like you, you tell me you got like a game designer sitting there whose like whole job it is like they're getting crunched every day for like 80 hours a week make the finest horse scrotum you can that's their job that's their that's their contribution to one of the best games of all mm-hmm. yeah <laughs> work harder like fucking dan hauser's walking behind them in the development is like all right steve i told you a week ago i wanted them balls looking shiny in 4k for the ps4 pro version of the game and dude's like, I'm trying my best, boss, okay? But these balls, they ain't getting bigger. They ain't getting flop like You know that meme with the guy in the office saying, we need ideas, and the three guys by the table that he kicks out of the window? You know yeah, that one meme? of them. <laughs> it's like, we need test the horse balls. Then the other guy is like, we need boob physics, and kicks him out of the window. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much what it is. <laughs> Dude, wait, is this a MatPat channel? Oh, no, it's King of Comparison. Sorry, I was, like, uh, looking to the side. I, like, my eye immediately got caught with the title comparison average women breast size by country i was like wow that can't was be a map video wow. <laughs> that, yeah map it, video. It, <laughs> dude, no he matched dude he matched this, this guy to- seo map <laughs> he could succeed if he uploaded that on like x videos or some shit oh, absolutely well, but yeah. he's never gone yeah. to x videos well look at this one can dig duck pop a human oh my god this is really messed up you click on his video for a second and it's just like the most sc- you know how YouTube like autoplays portions yeah. of the video? I literally like highlighted it and it looked like the worst operations ever. Like, I'm surprised this video has not been like that. That has not been blurred. Although my favorite video from him, and I guess I'll leave the topic on this one, is the are GTA 5 cops racist? Ironically, that was. <laughs> That's crazy. He actually That was a that unique that. video because I, I wanted to know what would happen. Because, like, I, I legitimately, yeah. when that happened, I was like, wait, is Rockstar yeah. Games brave enough to make, Dude. like, the police response oh my different? God. To fr- oh, my God. It's Franklin in the title. It's Franklin in the thumbnails. So you know exactly who he's going. He's Bruh. like... Jesus no, but it's, it's it, so funny. Like, I love the game theories that, like, go, like, way too far into reality. It's like, I th- Gaijin Goomba made a video, like, are Minecraft villagers Jews or something? <laughs> and I was like, oh... <laughs> I watched that one too. That's crazy. Like, the do that, that's insane, dude. Minecraft that's quite a theory. Jews. No, it's totally for sure. It's still there. There's no way he took it down, right? I mean, it, Notch. He he's yeah, the OG yeah. guy who put him <laughs> in, right? You never know. He's, he's a little sussy. <laughs> 
I, yeah, I, the video is gone, know, but it's replaced off. by another channel, Adam Smasher Time. Minecraft theory, conspiracy theory number one. Ooh. Villagers are Jewish number stereotypes. One. Okay. Number one. It's a good one to start off well, with. Well, I mean, <laughs> he, he, took that, he took down the video, but like there are other channels that are like, Game yeah. Theory thinks Minecraft villagers are Jewish. <laughs> like, oh.